Hey everyone, I wanted to share with you some of my favorite Osborne books. Um, I hope you enjoy. So, for my first series that I enjoy, I like the That's Not My series. Each one of these books is a board book and it's a touchy feel on each page. Um, this is perfect for your babies turning into toddlers. They can follow along and find the touchy feel. Also, there's a little mouse on each page of each of the books in the series, so that's always fun and an interactive way to get your kids looking while you're reading. Um, it's not just That's Not My Puppy. They have several That's Not My Plane, That's Not My Monster, going along with the baby books. I have the 123 foldable book. Um, it's $7.99 and it folds out in an accordion style. You can sit it up on the floor while your, your baby is doing tummy time. Um, also, when your baby starts crawling, they like to play with it and fold it in and out. And whenever your baby gets bored, you can flip it over to the back. Um, the contrast and colors keep their attention very well and it's also educational because you're learning how to count. Also, for the babies, we have the peek through books. These are kind of new and the, it's one of my new favorites. Um, this one's Are You There Little Fox? There's Are You There Little Elephant and Are You There Little Bunny as well. On each page you're looking for the fox and when you peek through the hole it ends up being a different animal like the ladybug um, there's also finger trails for your baby to follow along and touch and keep them interacting there's little holes and cutouts to keep them going and it's a cute little storyline you go through the book and you finally at the very end after all these animals that look like the fox you finally find the fox moving on up to our toddlers I have the what is series and this is the list of flap what is poop um, it's a very engaging book for those of you who are trying to potty train your toddler um, it starts off with everyone poops and on each page there's several with the flaps that you can pull and keep the kid engaged um, even the princess poops and then later on it shows you if you flush the toilet where the poop goes all down the pipes and what happens to it at the very end uh, it also shows different animal poop. So this is a great buy for those boys who are scared to poop still. Um, it's only $12.99. So there's also a What is Stars book that's with the flap, similar to this. This Muddle and Natch series is very popular. Um, this is the Muddle and Natch Fairy Tales. If you open it up, you can make your own story by flipping the different flaps. And you can mix match your different characters. This is the fairy tales one. I have jobs, superheroes. Um, it's really cool for those toddlers growing up who want to make up their own stories and a great way to introduce fairy tales to your little ones. As we continue to get up older with like our first graders or kindergartners who are learning how to rhyme and read, um, we have our phonics readers and each one of these is $6.99. You can buy them in a collected volume for cheaper. Um, these are paperback, and this is our newest one, one of our newest ones, Apes Great Escape. Um, as you can tell, it's rhyming. Um, the pictures keep the kids interacted. Also, if you look at the little blurbs, it talks about a little ape who escapes. And then at the end, I like these because it gives the parents some ideas about phonics and the phonemic awareness. So you have Apes Great Escape, and you also have, what these are the other new ones, Giraffe in the Bath. Or, and also Chimp with a Limp. So I think these are really cool to get the kids laughing and learn rhyming words as well. One of my very first bedtime story favorite books ever was Nibbles the Book Monster. And um, this is Nibbles and he likes to eat his way through different books. And on each page there's some kind of flap and you're always trying to find Nibbles throughout the book. And since he likes books, he eats his way through the, the, the Goldilocks and the Three Bears. And he eats his way through Little Red Riding Hood. And he just keeps eating his way through all the books. And the best part is at the end, he still he gets caught. And then he eats his way out of the book. And it's so cool because there's a hole in the book. Um, you can also buy the Nibbles plush that goes with the book for $12.99 too. Which, who doesn't love Nibbles the Book Monster? And now they have a Nibbles... The dinosaur guide so if you are already a fan of nibbles we have the nibbles dinosaur guide and especially for boys who like to read there's all these different flaps to keep the kids engaged and you're trying to find nibbles and he escapes again at the very end so great bedtime stories for your kids of all ages and speaking of bedtime stories um, we have our shine a light series 
And in these books, if you open it up and you're reading, you can use a flashlight in the dark and you hold the flashlight up through and you can see on the next page some kind of design. So this one's about space and if you hold it up, you can see the little spaceship through the um, page. So at nighttime, for those who don't really like to read, you can get out your little flashlight and tell your stories. We have the space one. Um, we have several Shine Light series. We have Secrets of Animal Camouflage. And one of my favorites is the human body. And you can look through and you can see the skeleton through the body. So really cool books. Um, they're only $12.99. They're hardback. And the flashlight is not included. So you need to bring your own flashlight. As we move on up to our older kids, we have these great nonfiction hardback books that are only $4.99. So that's super great deal, especially looking at the colors on these pages, um, the real pictures they use. I have some of these in my classrooms and all my kids go straight for these books um, because they're so sturdy and for $4.99, I have several of them. Some of them are even accelerated readers. So if you have some kids that read AR, um, you can look these up and see if they're on your child's level. So great buys of great seals and great presents for $4.99. What I love about Usborne is Usborne is not just for one age group of kids, it's for many ages. And so if we move on up to our chapter books, um, this is just an example of the younger kids' chapter books. Like if you're just starting out to read chapter books, I wanted you to see how large the print is and how separated it is. So it um, builds great readers for kids who want to start reading chapter books but aren't quite ready for the long books. Um, they, they're still reading a chapter book in, um, even though it's larger print. So um, this is the Billy B. Brown series and these books are only like $4.99. We also, if you have an older student who likes to read chapter books, um, this one is True Survival. It kind of reminds me of the I Survived books. Um, it's nonfiction, but as you can see, it's for older kids. Um, it tells different tales of survival. And then, this is one of our newer series for um, maybe some girls who enjoy animals, and um, it's the Tanglewood Animal Park series, and each one, some kind of wild animal is in need, and this girl comes and helps and rescues them. So, for your older boys who are reluctant readers, we have the new series, the Bear Girls um, series, and you might have seen his show on the Discovery Channel, I think that's what he comes on. But this is a great book. It's got great color in it, and it tells you different ways to survive out in the wilderness. Um, it's hardback. It's pretty thick. Um, I would recommend it for maybe third grade boys and up who um, enjoy the outdoors. Also, there's a, the Extreme Planet as well. If you like the Bear Grylls, um, series. You might also like the activity books that come along with this that you can buy separately. There's pictures, crosswords that go along with the survival. And also he has his own chapter books that we have for him. And last but not least, we also have activity books that we sell. Um, this is one of our academy books, the Coder Academy. So if you have anybody who wants to be a computer programmer, this would be a great buy. Um, there's a doctor academy, a vet academy, and basically it's just a little crash course of what you need to know to be that person. So if you're going to be a coder, it would tell you different things to be, what kind of math you will need. It even gives you practice tests so you can get prepared to be a coder. And I know spring break and summer are around the corner, so we have some small little activity books that you can buy. They're like $5.99, and they're perfect for the car. They have different things you can do on a car trip. Um, you can do mazes. There are stickers. There are little games throughout each of these. Um, I have the travel activity pad and 100 things to do in the car. And speaking of travel, I have the 1001 Things to Spot on Vacation. It's like an I Spy series books. Um, it's seven toy dolphins that you try to find, different things on each page that you're trying to find. There's all kinds of different ones that are 1001 Things to Spot. We also have several sticker books. This is the first train sticker book. Um, these are for your younger kids who like sticker books. The stickers are pretty large that you can peel off and they have the different pages where you can put them. So hopefully you guys have found something new that you might like as well. As always, if you have any questions, just send me a message.